A high-ranking ANC official and his three co-accused will know next week that they will be released on bail. The four were today formally charged with murder and two counts of attempted murder. This is in connection with the killing of former ANC Youth League Secretary General Cindy Sokmagata. Magata was shot during an ambush in July of 2017. The Mzumkulu Magistrates Court under police lockdown. Access was restricted. Hundreds of ANC and community members protested, also wanting a glimpse of the suspects charged with the murder of Cindy Sumakaka. The suspects, Mlule Gindobe, Siabonga Mieza, Mbulele Mpufana and Zweli Pantis Kosana, arrived under heavy police guard. In court, the state said it was ready for a bail hearing. However, two of the four defence counsels told the court they needed more time to prepare. The prosecution have indicated that they propose a relying on the provisions of Schedule 6, um, which relates to premeditated murder and two counts of attempted murder. Uh, certain procedural things will have to be produced to ensure that happens. Uh, but we intend to act on behalf of accused number four, and we propose on Monday to bring the application for his release on bail. The defence appealed to the court for a speedy bail hearing without delays. However, the state argued more suspects are still at large in the case. The bail hearing was then set down for Monday and Tuesday next week. Outside court, Magaka supporters called on the ANC to act against members implicated in serious offences. The party said its leaders are to meet soon to discuss how they will deal with such matters. We are faced with a situation where we've not been faced with before. You know, previously we don't have protocols on what happens when a white councillor is arrested, what happens when a mayor is arrested for that matter. Of course, we must always bear in mind that the constitution of the ANC says you, you cease to be a member of the ANC once you've been uh, there's a verdict, you've been found guilty of a particular crime. Now, in this instance, no one has been found guilty, but there are allegations and some are in court. So, we, as the ANC, we are engaging on that discussion. The accused were remanded in custody. I am Plongo, SABC News, Mzimkolo.